When you hit the ball from the fairway, there are two possible places it may land, either on the green or, unfortunately, in a bunker. If your ball lands in a bunker, the first thing you should do is to locate the rake and retrieve it. Once you have the rake, place it on the edge of the bunker close to your ball. From here, enter the bunker and walk directly to your ball, disturbing the sand as little as possible. When you're getting into position to take your shot, be careful not to ground or touch the sand with your club. Remember, touching your club in the sand before you've taken your shot is against the rules. After you've taken your shot, rake out all the areas of the sand disturbed by your shot, including your footprints, so the bunker appears exactly as it did before you entered it. If you think back, we discussed the one more rule with regard to replacing divots at the tee-off area and on the fairway. We'd like to extend this rule and apply it to bunkers as well. So if you happen to notice that either a small animal or negligent golfer has left any prints in the bunker, take several seconds out of your game to fix them. Not only does this practice set a good example for other golfers, it allows everyone to enjoy a tidier course.